doing a project on sisal scans and recycling bottles, the plastic bottles. We recycle them because we want to stop the water pollution. This project is called Recycling of Recyclable Materials Using Robotics. We have to protect our water and air from different pollutants. That's why this project was made and was named uh, like this. My name is Ella Herrera and I am from Teva International in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. And I'm doing a project on aquaponics. Aquaponics is a sustainable method of raising both fish and vegetables. I'm from South Africa, as you can see. Uh, my project is a domestic water recycle system. It's basically taking the grey water from your household. And once the water from here is, uh, gets collected, this pump then pumps the dirty water into a filtration system. Um, my name is Shilin Lucas. I'm a student from grade 10A, Pula International School, Maputo, Mozambique. And my project is about the effectiveness of biofuels. My project is about canola and chachofa. How is it good for the environment and how can we change it? How can we substitute all of the traditional fossil fuels? My name is Sofia and my project is about infected freshwater snails as indicators of water body safety. My name is Shema Omerovic and I'm from Bosnia and Herzegovina and our project is about the biofuel from uh, the plant in Wisconsin. I'm Ispan Vantovic, I'm from Bosnia and Herzegovina. My project is the River Port, Texas. The main idea of this project was uh, generating power and cleaning water at low cost. Our project is about color changing rose. First, we need white roses. Second, we need three glasses. Third, we need food color. Fourth, we need water. Fifth, we need a sharp knife. And if you want to make it one color, you take the whole rose and just place it inside like this one. And after 15 minutes, the rose will change its color into beautiful colors. I've been a jury for this kind of event for the last couple of years. But today has been quite unique. I'm coming across young people who have really done great improvements. And really, if this trend is going to continue, we are likely to produce wonderful scientists in this region of the world. So I'll just encourage that uh, we have more and more participation into this. Being a Kenyan, I encourage more Kenyans to join into this international community so that they can also be able to show out their talents.
country, we are delighted to support this kind of events and the kind of talent I've seen here this afternoon, the kind of presentations, this is actually the world having come to Kenya to celebrate this event.